The Navy has always been a passion of mine. Seeing the Navy growing up, the Lebanese Navy, seeing international navies, seeing the Maritime Task Force navies, has always been the primary motivation to join the Navy and join the Military Academy and the Naval Academy. The type of uh, the ship is a uh, 053H2 frigate. يكون ضابط بحري بلبنان هي شيء كثير مميز لانه الضباط البحريين معدودين ولازم يكون عندهم مؤهلات كرياضيه وعلميه كثير عاليه. العلوم البحريه هي كل شيء خاصه بالبحر، الملاحه، كل شيء خاصه بالمطيرات، المناوره، قانون البحار وكل كل هالاشياء. ادرات 5 Clear starboard. My job is to command this ship and to ensure the safety of the people on board, ensure the safety of the ship, and to uh, do the mission at hand, which is secure the safety and security of the Lebanese territorial waters. The Maritime Task Force operates with seven ships from six contributing countries. So we have ships from Bangladesh, Brazil, Germany, Greece, Indonesia, and Turkey. So this is about 900 uh, people uh, with the crews and also the staff. And we operate at sea, assisting the LAF Navy in preventing the entrance of illegal arms in any of the Lebanese ports. So this has a very important connection with uh, the United Nations Security Council Resolution 1701. Sea Angelos, motor vessel Sea Angelos. This is the United Nations warship. Over. This is Bravo 5 Hotel. Over. The units will be participating in these exercises are the MTF units, the Maritime Task Force units. The information we have, the information we collect from the hailing procedure and how the target and how the contact is reacting, we classify this ship as a hostile or as a friendly or a suspect vessel. Then comes in the second step, which is to intercept the vessel, to board it, to search it for any illegal activities or any illegal smuggling. That way we can provide early warning and we can provide early interception of any acts of uh, violation to the Lebanese laws in the side of territorial waters. So what you can see there now is that they have the UNIFIL flag in the top and a little uh, below you see the flag Romeo. Flag Romeo uh, is for replenishment at sea and the mailbag transfer we want to do now is the uh, replenishment at sea. Are we ready to receive the gun yes, line? Yes we are. Okay, Roger. Joint training with UNIFIL, it helped us work Lebanese Navy and worldwide navies to speak the same language, to uh, make use of the expertise the UNIFIL have, and they can make use of the expertise we have. Yeah, um, so guys, great job, you all did very well, and the best thing is that we all did it in a very safe measure. <laughs> We do uh, firefighting, uh, medical training uh, in port, the first days, and now today, the final day, we do the same at sea. What's the next size? What do you yeah. think? Being a peacekeeper is an honor for me, of course, because uh, not so many people can do this. Uh, it's a real mission, helping people is like to improve yourself, to be honored about that. We definitely feel like we are peacekeepers. We operate here with uh, ships, uh, helicopters from the ships. So we can say that we are peacekeepers at sea, on land and in the air. Hey! Hey!